Um, so what else happened this week? We had the 1559. Miku, you want to tell us about uh, about that a little bit? Is that a good thing or a bad thing? It sounds like an inoculation or something. Some, uh... Oh, it's it's extremely exciting. I think that the place to go actually look at it is uh, watchitburn.com. So that's a pretty amazing, uh, amazing website. You, you know, basically what's happening now is that the Ethereum network is uh, basically burning ETH, right? So it, it's basically decreasing the supply and that, that, that makes for, uh, you know, really exciting... Uh, kind of economic uh, effects, right? So this is what uh, Vitalik referred to as ultrasound money, right? So, uh, you know, he's making fun of the Bitcoiners that say that, uh, you know, the asymptotic 21 million Bitcoin threshold is sort of sound money, right? So that now Ethereum is actually like being burned by uh, this this proposal. So yeah, I'm sharing really my screen. Exciting. I'm sharing my screen if... Uh... If you guys want to see, so this is the site I think you were talking about, right? Yeah, watch the burn. Yeah, you can see how yeah. much has been burned, and it's it's pretty sizable. It's definitely millions of dollars worth of uh, ETH, which is great. The, the, so Ethereum is migrating from uh, proof of work to proof of stake, and this is the first step where actually every block, the fees in every block, are broken into. Okay, what is going to the miners? Because we still have miners there and what goes to be burned. But after we launch ETH2, which is sometime next year, 100% uh, of that is gonna go to the stakers.